It will be an all-day event on Sunday as downtown San Luis Obispo expects a busy day for St. Patrick's Day. I'm Dylan Foreman, your community reporter in San Luis Obispo, as local businesses and police are preparing for the holiday. For college students, it's a weekend-long spectacle that begins with a block party on Saturday dubbed St. Fratty's Day, followed by traditional St. Patrick's Day festivities throughout downtown. The pinnacle of like my college experience is every St. Fratty's Day, yeah. I would say. Cruise down to Hathaway, um, probably climb the telephone pole, maybe like go out on the wire this year. Yeah. I don't know, hopefully run before the cops get us. <laughs> but that will be difficult. So throughout the weekend, the police department has significantly increased staffing to a very large number of officers going to be in town. Um, uh, some outside agencies are going to be assisting us as well. For local bars like Buffalo Pub and McCarthy's, they're expecting the biggest crowds they'll see all year. Sure up the staff, security staff, bartenders, you know, just make sure everybody's able to be taken care of. We're adhering to, you know, ABC, fire, um, PD, making sure our capacity is always in check, um, making sure everybody's safe and having a good time. Inventory is part of the preparation as well. A McCarthy's bartender told me they have 30 kegs of Guinness and 18 cases of Jameson. While it's not quite that number at Buffalo Pub, General Manager James Menno says it will be one of, if not the biggest day for alcohol sales that they'll see during the year. A whole lot of Jameson, a whole lot of Guinness. Um, I mean, those are, you know, obviously the biggest two for the big day, but yeah, we probably order about half a dozen cases of Jameson. Um, about four kegs of Guinness and we'll go through probably almost all of it on, on St. Patty's Day. But above all else, it's a weekend to be safe and responsible while also having fun. That means don't drink and drive, use a restroom, not a neighborhood, and... Make sure you take care of each other, drink lots of water, and call us if, if you need us for something. According to many of the bars I spoke to, doors will open at 6 a.m., including the one behind me, McCarthy's, which is expected to have a line most of the day. In San Luis Obispo, I'm Dylan Foreman, KSBY News.